Hello everyone and welcome back to Jack Scraps. Thanks for joining me today. I have a haul to share with you from American Crafts and this was a 75% off sale specific to the Heidi Swap shop on American Crafts and I jumped on it and I got so many goodies for such a great deal. Everything that I'm showing you today, I got for like $82.26. So I did go a little crazy. Let me jump in and show you what I got. So let's start with these mink glue pens. I got the fine tip and the wide tip and you get one in each package. I have never used these and I thought these would be good for like uh, your journaling or if you're traveling and to use the glue stick. So I wanted to pick those up. I also got the Mink Stamp Cleaner. Now I think this is for the toner uh, that she has, which I already bought from scrapbook.com and I just thought it would be good to have this on hand to help clean that off when and if I ever use it. <laughs> so those are the three mink products that I got. I also picked up this brush. It is a one inch like stencil type brush. I thought this would be good to have on hand. Now I'm really getting into photo corners and so I found a box with five colors in it. You get 40 pieces of photo corners and these are the colors that you get. Now I may already have this one. I bought a couple of them because they were such a great deal. Um, but I love having these colors on hand. I'm, maybe this isn't the one I have. I think the one I have is pastels. This has black, like a green, lime, pink, gold, and white. I picked up these receipt pockets. Uh, these are for your memory planner, but really you could use these in any type of memory keeping that you're doing. You get six in a package. Here they are. Because I haven't really looked at any of the products that I'm showing you today, so we're seeing them together. You get two of the gold striped. That's nice. Kind of wrinkly, but other than that, they're still pretty nice. Here is one that says, love this, in gold foiling. And oh, you can see through that one as well with the flower there. That's really pretty. And then we have gold foil dots. I love that these are all see-through. So I picked up this Magnolia Jane Ephemera. There are 54 pieces in there. I do have the paper already, so I thought I would get this. I know they're very little, but that's what you get. I'm not gonna open these up because there's just so much to share. Then I bought two of these packages that have the acetate words in them. This is from the Hawthorne collection. Those are the words that you get. There are 12 in the pack. And this one is from the Hawthorne collection as well. And those are the ones you get in this package. So you have the black and then this really pretty color here. So they're just acetate words like that. Really nice. This view, there's Wander. Magical, love it. Now what's great about these is you could add foil to the top of them and run them through the mink or your laminating machine, I'm sure, and foil the pieces. Now I've been wanting these for a while, but they are the Heidi Swap Memory Dex dies. You get two in each pack. This one has the tabs in it. And then this one has the oval and then the one with the corners cut out of it. These were $5.50 each, such a great deal. I grabbed this ephemera pack from the Emerson collection. There are 64 pieces in here and those are all the ones you get. You get some acetate with foiling and then the cardstock ephemera pieces. I'm sorry I'm not showing you everything that's in the packages. If you want me to do that, let me know and I'll do that in another video. I picked up this great stamp and die set. 
Let me open this one up though to show you. So here are the stamps. You get this wreath that says Be Merry and Bright, A Dear Merry Season of Giving, Joy, and We Wish You A. And then you have the word Christmas in her handwriting. But then down here below, you get the wreath die, you get the word Christmas die, and the deer. I thought this was a great deal, so I couldn't pass it up. I found this Journal Studios pouch, and I picked that up. I mean, I saw things that I've never seen before on this website. <laughs> so what's nice about this is you can, if I can. Okay, well, it opens up this way. It's for a traveler's notebook. You can put your string through here. On this side, it's like an envelope and it has the string closure here, which I can't undo right now. But then that opens up, you could put stuff in. And then on this side, you have a slide closure. And then you could open it up, put your things in there. So I think this is really great. So I picked up this set of gold clipboards. You get two that are six and a half by eight and a half. And then you get one, which is 12 and a half by nine. And I just like these uh, to put on the wall in a wall collage. And you can even, the way, I love that these are wrapped individually. And the way that it shows here is that you could even uh, decorate these with paint or whatever. So you don't have to leave them white. You could decorate them the way that you want. Right here, she's showing one of her screen stencils, acrylic paint. In addition to getting the Memory Dex dies, I also picked up the black Memory Dex spinner, and this was also only $5.50. I could not believe it. I am so excited about that. I don't mind having black. I kind of like that. Uh, so I'm so excited about all this stuff that I got. I grabbed this wax seal stamp set. It has her flower that she does, uh, usually a rose, I think, and it has a pink and white wax, and then it has a handle as well for that set. I grabbed the colored staples that she has, and this goes with her um, small staple. I have it, but not with me right now, so I can't show you, but it's the number 10 staples. You get pink, and black, 2,000 pieces. And I also grabbed these reinforcement stickers, yellow, uh, like a bright pink, light pink. There's a pale peachy color, lime green, and another pink there, 240 pieces. So I picked up these stickers because this is Heidi's handwriting and you get 183 puffy stickers. I thought this was great to have. And the white. And then I also picked up these puffy stickers and this is Winter Wonderland, 192 pieces. I absolutely love the candy cane style of these alpha, really cute. And then I picked up these stickers and this goes with one of the collections. I'm not sure which one. Might be carefree. I don't know. Yeah, I th I'm thinking that might be carefree. I'm not, I'm not certain. But there are 61 stickers in this. Really pretty. Some foiling down here. And then you get all these great labels on the back side. Also grab some of these foil flakes. She had it in silver and in rose gold. And these I think were a dollar each. Next, I'm going to share some of her paper collections that I picked up and that I didn't have in my stash. Uh, this one is the Emerson Lane and it is the six by six pad. There are 36 sheets in here. I'll just go through it real quick. 
You may be familiar with the collections that I am showing, but for those that aren't, I'm going to go ahead and flip through. Nice ledger there, really pretty. And then there are some that repeat. It doesn't look like they all, that's not a repeat. Interesting. Oh, there it is. I must've missed it on oh, that one. Yeah, so then there's a few that repeat, but not all of them. The next one I have to share is Old School and it's the six by eight pad. 36 sheets. Now, if you'll recall, I just bought a couple sheets of the 12 by 12, so this will go great with that. You're one of a kind, weekend vibes. I just love this paper right here. Some nice cut parts there. It's like film strip. And then there's a few again that repeat. The next one that I picked up is Art Walk. This is the six by eight paper pad and you get 36 designs. Some cut aparts. These look like great layering pieces or to make tags out of these. Ooh, I like the pink and the orange. Another leather ledger. That's pretty. And then it looks like, again, you have a few that repeat. Next, I picked up a couple of her Storyline Chapters project pads. And this one is, what size is that? This is, a little bit over seven and a half by a little bit over nine and a half. Now what's interesting about this is these look almost the same, but they have different innards. So you have to be really careful when picking these up. You may end up with the same one <laughs> and not realize it. So the front page, let's see the front three, the first three pages are stickers which is really great. It's really a nice quality sticker too. It's very thick. Really nice. And then here is the paper that you get. There's some cut aparts. And with the project pads, you get solid cardstock. But again, these are great to layer or to create tags out of. Here's the next one that I have. 
So I believe the top sheet is clear stickers, yes. And then the next two are white, on white sticker paper. Here is the next paper pad that I picked up. This is a six by eight storyline chapters paper pad. So you'll see the difference. Project pad, paper pad. <laughs> there are 36 sheets in this. You'll see some of the patterns repeat, like look here, this one to that one, right here. But the thing is, if you only get this one, you're missing out on all these other designs. So there's crossover in the project and paper pads. And then I think this starts to repeat. Oh. Lots of cut aparts in there. Really nice. That's a good, nice pad. Now, while I was extremely excited over the Memory Dex dies and the desktop spinner, I was even more excited to be able to pick up her. Um, what does she call this? Is this, I think this is more of her storyline items. So I have one of the storage albums. I got the gray one. The black looked like it had stuff on it, so I didn't pick that one up. And then there was a pink one, but I didn't really like the color. It was kind of pukish. <laughs> so I opted for the gray one. Now I wish I would have bought more than just the one, but this is the one I got because I was telling you I wanted to get back to Traveler's Notebooks, and then I picked up this, and I'm thinking this is what I'm going to do next year for documenting, so I'm really kind of excited about it. So I got the One Storage album, and then I picked up these. <laughs> So we have the scrapbook inserts, we have planner inserts, and journaler inserts. Okay, I think we'll start with the planner inserts. This is a three-pack planner insert. There are 26 weeks in each of the inserts. So again, I haven't seen any of this. I took one of her classes where she was using this but I haven't really gotten into the whole thing of how it works. So it looks like you have your weekly pages here. It's nice that there's different colors for each week. And let's see what else you got. So in the back you have room for inspiration and some notes. So that's what this is. It is 26 weeks of weekly pages. So if you're documenting um, your day, you could do that here, like memory planning. And then there's this one with the lemons on it, really pretty. So the color scheme looks like the same, and this one. Oh, hold on, sister. <laughs> Okay, so these are the weeklies, and this one is different. 
So when we go into this, like I said, I'm not real familiar with it. You have your year overview. You have a little box for each month. You have the month of calendar, some remember, your monthly calendar, and some notes on the side. On the back side, you have some more room, like you could do one through 31. You're grateful, things that are coming up, important dates here. And then you have events, remember, goals, highlights of the month. And then it goes into another month. So let's see, does this repeat beyond three months? No. So this is looks like for a whole year. Well, that's cool. So I guess you would use this to kind of mark what's happening. And then you take this and transfer it into your weekly when you're actually doing your documenting. So I guess that's how that works. That's the planner inserts. Next is the journal inserts. And there are three in this package as well. Now, you remember we saw these covers in the paper. So this paper is dotted. And this one is the grid pattern. And then this last one is blank. It's a pretty heavy weight. So that's nice. So that's the journal inserts. The last inserts I have are the scrapbooker inserts. You get three of those. Here's what they look like. Looks like a linen pattern on there. And then that linen pattern continues on to the page. I hope that you can see that. So the pages aren't white like they were and the journal set, they have this linen type pattern, but you know, it's a smooth paper. So this is blank. We have the dotted one and it has the same type of paper in it. Again, I hope you can see that just so that you can get an idea. So it's like working with, you know, blank paper. And then you have this really pretty one as well with the same type. So that is everything that I picked up from American Crafts Heidi Swap Shop uh, for the 75% off sale. I hope you were able to uh, go out there and get some things too. I don't know if that sale is still going on or not, um, but I was super, super excited about everything that I got. Now, since we are talking about Heidi, let me show you what else I'm doing. <laughs> So I've been following Heidi a lot on Instagram and I became familiar with her Stamp Society and her Stop the Blur Memory Planner Kit. And so I signed up for the stamp kit a couple months back and I, I'm absolutely loving it. I'm telling you, if there is any stamp subscription that you get, I think it should be Heidi Swap. Her stamps are unique and I love them. They are great for storytelling. And so I wanted to share with you the stamp sets that I have already. I don't have my uh, fourth uh, subscription yet. It's uh, on its way to me. So I'll show you the first three that I have available. So here's one that I received. It is this set of alphabet and the numbers. And then you also get like the dollar sign, the percentage, ampersand and all these other little goodies to go along with the stamp set. I love that because you don't often get all of these extras. Oh, here's the at sign, the hashtag, even a parenthesis. So when they come, they come in this uh, sleeve, which is super nice. I love having them. I'm a little spoiled now and I want all my stamps and sleeves, but I really love that. And it says it's a six by eight clear stamp set. The next one I have are definitions. And I'm telling you, this is like, <laughs> it's like Heidi Gold right here. Uh, so she has words on here such as bloom, 
which was my word of the year, um, or is, happiness, vacation, tranquil, fearless, carpe diem, paradise, favorite, captivate, crazy, uh, carefree, and just all kinds of other words. But she gives you the definition of those. I absolutely love them. Here's to give you an up-close look. Again, this is a six by eight clear stamp set. And then the last one that I have right now is this set. I love this. It has the banners here or these flags. Is that what they're called? I'm not sure. Penance. That's right. These are penance. And then she has these words that fit within the penance. It's awesome. You have these little bursts here that you can put around it. Here are some more words and these as well. Good times. Love it. Super chill out. Be happy. Heck yes. I love that one. I just love this. And the, you even get like the stem of the pennant. Um, just so much fun. I so highly recommend this. I'm super excited for the one that's coming this month as well. Now, the next one I have to share, I started this probably a couple months in uh, on the Stamp Society. So this is the Stop the Blur Memory Planner Kit. Again, if you get the year-long subscription, it is so worth it. You get a really nice uh, bit of material for the price. So here is the one that I have received. You, They always come in these little pouches and it says, tell your story on it here in white and her name, of course. Now I have some other memory keeping stuff in here. I see, but let me pull out everything that came in the kit. Um, apparently I was getting ready for something. <laughs> okay, so you get the bag, you get a washi. I love this one with the ledger numbers, one through 18, just kind of cute to use. Again, very unique. You got these little pockets. How cute are these with the little baby card? And again, she has her like distressing on the little pockets. And then we got some of these tear apart tickets. And what I mean by that is they are perforated right there. So you get she does a color theme, which is really nice, and it goes along with the season throughout the year. And this was the color theme for this time. Uh, the, the quality of the material is really nice. It's always packaged well. And then you always get a set of alphabet. I love this color. And they are clear, so you can see through them. So really nice. Yeah, I loved that color. And then you got these Hello Goodbye stickers. Um, at first I thought, what would you do with these? But it's like Hello Autumn, Goodbye Summer, things like that. So that's kind of fun. And then you always get a stamp set, I believe. And this is so cute. I love the little bars. This is great for bullet journaling. You have the days of the week. And I love the small size. That's what you need when you're documenting. Sometimes you just need the smaller size of the days of the week. So this is great. So that just gives you a little taste of the Stop the Blur Memory Planner Kit as well as the Stamp Society. So that's my entire Heidi haul <laughs> for today. Thank you for joining me. I hope you have enjoyed this. I just have so excited about everything again that I got. And um, I'm sure you'll be seeing some of these products in the future. Thanks a lot for joining me and I'll see you next time.